Closing arguments in the trial of Andre McDonald expected to begin tomorrow. This trial has been on recent since Monday because of all of the icy weather. It left off with Andre taking the stand and revealing shocking details about what he says led up to his wife Andrine's death. Eric Hernandez spoke with a forensic psychologist who says the jury right now has a lot to consider. As soon as she fell, it was like a reaction, you know, so I, I landed like a couple of kicks. Little emotion. I started like, you know, hitting the body with the hammer. How many times? Honestly, I, I couldn't tell you, but it was multiple times. Or remorse as Andre McDonald described what happened between he and his wife and how he disposed of her body. I think he's someone that believes that this is how it actually went down. I don't believe him. Local forensic psychologist John De La Torre, who has no involvement in this case, saw the testimony and offered his opinion to McDonald's responses while on the stand. It's certainly possible that he's not being fully upfront about what he actually did during that interaction between the two of them. When asked what he thought about McDonald denying his actions as murder and even blaming his wife for the situation. The problem comes in is how does he think of his role with regard to his spouse? He thinks that uh, whatever she does must be controlled by him. That's not narcissism. Right, that's domestic and intimate partner violence. Overall, De La Torre doesn't believe McDonald's testimony, and we will have to wait to see if the jury feels the same. Closing arguments are expected Thursday morning at 9 a.m. If found guilty, McDonald faces up to life in prison. Erica Hernandez, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.